Matthew 12 and verse 43, when the unclean spirit is gone out of a man, he walks through dry places seeking rest and finds none. Then he says, I will return into my house from whence I came out. And when he has come, he findeth it the house that had been cleansed from the devil. He findeth it empty, swept, and garnished. Then he goes, notice friends, he does not enter into the man when he comes back. He goes to see the condition, but then the Bible says that he goes and takes with himself seven other spirits, more wicked than himself, and they enter in and dwell there. And the last of the man is worse than the first. Even so shall it be also unto this wicked generation. In this parable, Jesus is giving to us both an urgent invitation as well as a very serious and solemn warning. And the primary point of the parable is that it is not enough for us to be emptied of evil. We must be filled in order to be fulfilled. We must be saturated with the Spirit in order to be satisfied with salvation. You see, my brothers and my sisters, Christianity is not about being emptied of wrong, it's rather about being filled with what is right, with the righteousness of Christ.